hamstring curls to start, reach and pull, heel the butt, timer's on. All right, tried to record Tuesday, it was a disaster. My Wi-Fi went nutty. Hopefully that won't happen today. That never happens. <laughs> oh. Almost never. Elbow to knee crisscross is next on the beep. Here you go. Nice and tall on this. Hinge and swing will be next in eight seconds. Three, two, and one. Hinge and swing here. Thrust your hips forward. Arms should be a little bit weightless on the way up. Back is nice and straight. Bend your knees a little bit. Don't let your head go lower than your hips. That will make you dizzy. There's your beep, nice and tall front kicks. This time I want you to reach with the opposite hand toward the toe that is kicking up. Jog in place is next. There's your beep. Jog in place. Move around your room if you have space. Side skips will be coming up next in 10 seconds. Get some lift. Here's your beat for side skips. Go. Use the arms to help you get some lift on this as well. Don't want your shoes to catch on the carpet. Changing the warm up just a little bit in eight seconds, we're going to jog in place again. A little more intensity second time through now that we're a little bit more warmed up. Here's your beep. Jog in place, move around a little faster, knees a little higher. We will side skip again as well in 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Side skip, this time punch across, side skip, punch across. Skip, 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 punch across. Up in the warm up just a bit here. Next set on the beep, jumping jacks. You can do modified or regular or some of each. Three, two, one. Change it to jacks. Turn my timer on. Yes, I did. <laughs> 15 seconds left in this interval. There's your beep. Let me change my timer for the next one. Okay, changing the squat. Instead of squat side bend, I want you to squat down, come up, one hip circle, alternate legs. Squat down, up, hip circle. All right, I'm warm. Sweatshirt's coming off. I'm wearing new workout pants today. I'm very excited. I have a ton of workout clothes, as you can imagine, but they are all getting stretched out at the same time. <laughs> all right, done with that. Now, step back. Gently push your heel to the floor, arms overhead. Alternate the sides. This one, and then our forward bends, and then we'll be ready for the workout.
I might tighten up the workout a little so we can aim for three sets. We'll see. Something about this workout, everything takes a little longer. I am recording today, so we will complete the workout. Um, so we have a full recording. There's your beat three times, big stretch up, forward bend. So it might be longer than the 45 minutes. Roll it up, do that again. Forward bend, roll it up one more time. Forward bend, stay here, hold for three deep breaths. And bend your knees, hug your abs in, roll yourself up. All right, two strength exercises, one cardio burst. The strength exercise, the first one's bottom half squat cross punch. So you can hold light weights if you want. I'm gonna hold threes. It's bottom half bottom up punch. So you twist a little bit and punch across the body. No weight or light weights. Exercise two is the side raise, hinge, reverse fly. That's one stand side raise hinge, reverse fly, that's two. Cardio burst, one jack, one kick, one jack, one kick. So if you wanna use light weights for the bottom half squat punch, grab those now. We're going 10 reps total. Hold those at your shoulders, ready, set, here we go. Bottom half, bottom, half, bottom, up punch. Bottom, half, bottom, up punch. Here's three, here's four, five, ooh, legs, <laughs> six, maybe I'm not warmed up yet, seven, eight, sit back in the heels, chest up, nine, and 10. Done with that for set one. Medium weights are good for side raise hinge, anywhere from three to 10 pounds, depending on how you feel today. All right, on the side raise, palms forward, and on the hinge, reverse fly, palms face center here. That's upper back exercise. Grab those weights, we're ready. Here we go, side raise, hinge down, reverse fly, stand side raise, Hinge down, reverse fly. Back is flat, knees are slightly bent on the hinge. Here's three. Three, shoulder blades pull together on that. Four. Four, brace your abs before you do the fly. Five. Five, ooh, I went, yeah, my weights, I'm feeling it. Six. Six. Seven. Seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, one more each, ten, and ten. Stand carefully, set those down with good form. Get ready for your cardio burst. One jack, one front kick, three. Two, one, go. One jack, one kick. One jack, one kick. Almost done. There's your beep, walk around, catch your breath. Bottom half squat, cross punch coming up next. If you're using weights, grab those. Light weights are good for this one, not heavy. All right, get those weights to your shoulders. We're pushing so we can get three sets. Ready, set. 
here we go, bottom half, bottom, half, bottom, up punch, bottom, half, bottom, punch. Here's three, keep that tempo, four, five, six, seven, my legs feel fatigued today, eight, nine, and Whew, good, rest, <laughs> grab your weights for the side raise, reverse fly, set two, take a few deep breaths, palms face forward for the side raise, and when you raise them, they're just a little bit forward, they're not flared way out to the sides, when you raise them up, ready, set, here we go, lift them up, one, hinge and fly, one, stand tall, two, two, abs and glutes are braced, three, second set, best set, three, four, four, five, five, six. Remember, if 10 is too much, you can stop at eight or nine or whatever works for you that day. Two more each position, nine, nine, 10 and 10, oh, that felt hard. Use good form to set those weights aside. Get ready for your one jack, one kick. Take a deep breath. Three, two, one, go. One jack, one kick. Get that kick a little bit higher. Try not to fully extend the knee on the kick. Get some good lift on the jack. Quiet feet, soft landings. Look at my timer, six seconds. Three, two, and one. Walk around, we're gonna go set three. Shorter rests. Get ready for your bottom half squat, light weights optional. Get ready, take one more deep breath. Here we go, bottom half squat. Bottom, half, bottom, up punch. Bottom, half, bottom, punch. Three, keep that tempo. Try to pause in each position, sit back in the heels, chest up, that's four. Flex the glutes when you press up out of this. Six. That was seven. Home stretch, home stretch, eight, <laughs> nine, and 10. Done with that move. Adjust weights when you need to. I'm gonna go down for set three because the weight which was challenging for me. And I wanna have a good set and not risk it. Side raise, hinge and fly, ready. Nice and tall, here we go. Side raise, one. Hinge and fly, one, up, two. See, now these feel too easy and the other ones felt too hard. So that's the, that's the trick. <laughs> so I push for two sets and I'm being cautious on set three. Here's four. Exercise, live to exercise another day as one of my friends puts it. <laughs> Leave a little in the tank. Here's six. Knees are soft on that hinge, back is nice and straight. Seven, seven, eight, 
I like to show this one from the side. Eight, two more if you can. Nine, definitely feeling heavy by nine. One more, 10. 10, with good form, stand, set those down. One jack, one kick. Take a deep breath. Three, two, one, go. Third and final set. Heart rate gets up more when we take real short breaks between those exercises. Extra cardio, there's your beep. Done with that circuit, walk around. Control your breathing and get a drink. Coming up next, we have the side lunge. 10 reps, one leg, 10 reps, the other, and then push-ups, incline or on the floor. And then um, side skips, punch across. Or burpees, I will let you choose. Push-ups and burpees are two wrist bearing in a row. So if you prefer side skips to get your cardio, fine. If you prefer burpees, fine. Lateral lunges first. Those of you who are experienced with this or find this exercise not overly challenging, you can hold one dumbbell in the opposite hand of the moving leg, hinge it toward that foot and then stand. That's an option. I might do that in set two. All right, side lunge, strong leg first. If you know which one is your dominant side or stronger side, do that on set one. 10 reps, here we go. Step it out, reach toward the floor, bend just that knee and then kick back to the start position. Here's two, a little slow on the way down, a little fast on the way up. Three, push away, four, push away, back stays nice and straight. Five, you don't have to touch the floor. Six, seven, eight, watch that ankle, don't let it roll. Nine, and 10, good. Ooh. <laughs> I overshot that one. Other side, ready, set, go, step it out. One, push off. Two, nice and low on that. Sink your butt behind you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice big step out to that side. Nine, getting a stretch on the inner thighs there and 10. Good, rest. Push-ups, inclined or floor, knees or toes on floor. I'm gonna do incline for set one. I want you to count your 10 push-ups. If you're fast and you need to do a few more, that's fine. Do 10 really good push-ups. Count your reps. The bottom of the push-up, arms make an arrow. Hands just a little bit wider than shoulder distance. Strong, tight core, exhale, push. Count your reps. Try to touch your chest to the edge or the floor. Rest after your 10. 30 second cardio burst coming up next. You can do burpees or side skip punch across. I'm gonna do side, side skip punch across. Take a deep breath. Going in three, two, one, go.
10 seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Ooh, walk around. Control your breathing. Pushing, we're pushing. On the side lunge, weaker side first. So start with the opposite side. All right, I'm gonna hold the weight for this one and give that a whirl. 10 reps on one leg, get set. Here we go, step it out. One, push away. Two, weight makes this extra evil. Three, and it's not even a super heavy one. Four, back stays nice and straight. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Whew. Very short rest until the other side. Take a deep breath. Take another. All right, here we go. Step it out. One, push away. Two, lower with control and then power up. Three, four, five. I feel like I've gotten stronger at this though. Six, still hard, but I can do it. Seven, ah. eight, nine, 10. Good, rest. On push-ups, 10 reps. I want you to find a push-up variation that you can get your chest really low. So if that means incline, it means incline. Doing two inch push ups on the floor makes it much harder to make progress. Count your 10. Nine. Remember to make an arrow with your upper arms when they're bent. Strong core, straight line of the body. Oh my. I know, right? Hi, yeah, yeah. They're just always hard. They're always hard. Catch your breath for a few counts. Chair burpees or side skips. Pick your cardio. Take a deep breath. Take one more. Going in three, two, one, go. Whatever you're doing, light on your feet. When you try to be light on your feet, your core gets involved. You get a little bit lifted. It's easier on the joints. Heart rate up. Four, three, two, and rest. Walk around. This is a hard circuit. Nice and slow breathing. Quick drink if you need it. Set three is coming up. Oh, it's hard. Side lunges are first. Weak leg first. Weak leg first. Take a deep breath. Take one more. Here we go. Step it out. One, up to 10 is what your goal is. So if you have to stop at seven or eight, it's fine. Two, three, one or two messy reps is fine. You don't want like a whole set of messy reps. Here's five, six. You sort of know, cause you get stuck at the bottom and it's hard to push up. Seven, right about now, eight. Nine, 
and 10, switching sides. I'm just breathing heavy into the recording this whole time. <laughs> Other side, three, two, one, step it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Good. Done with that move. Push ups, push ups, push ups. Incliner floor. Pick your poison. Again, aim for ten. If it's extra hard. Whatever variation, you only get to seven or eight. No, no harm done as long as you're pushing your boundaries a bit. Count your reps. <laughs> Stand up right away when you're done. Start walking it off. Get ready for the final cardio burst. Burpees or side skips. Take a deep breath. Take one more. Three, two, one, go. Give it all you got last hard cardio push. Ten seconds left. Eight, six, four, three, two, and one. Woo, success. Walk around, try not to sit down. You can sit down if you feel dizzy or queasy. Otherwise, it's better and safer to stay up. And try to slow your heart rate and breathing. <sighs> <sighs> 